Welcome to Latest World News. Two nephews of Venezuela's First Lady have been arrested in Haiti and taken to the U.S. to face drug trafficking charges, U.S. media reports say. Frank Y. Francisco Flores de Freitas and Efrain Antonio Campo Flores are accused of conspiring to smuggle 800 kilograms of cocaine into the United States. The two men are due to appear before a federal judge in New York on Thursday. Venezuela has not commented on the reported arrests which follow on from an airspace violation row on Sunday. Venezuelan Defense Minister Vladimir Padrino said that a U.S. plane had wrongfully entered the South American country's airspace. Although Venezuela has repeatedly accused the U.S. of meddling in its affairs, ties between the two countries have improved since reaching a low point in March when the U.S. imposed sanctions on a number of Venezuelan officials for alleged human rights abuses. The U.S. has repeatedly maintained that drug trafficking is taking place at the highest echelons of President Nicolas Maduro's administration. The extradition of the two men comes just three weeks ahead of key Venezuelan legislative elections. The two suspects are reported by U.S. officials to have been arrested in the Haitian capital Port-au-Prince after arriving from Venezuela aboard a private plane. Reports say that while both have diplomatic passports neither has diplomatic immunity. The pair were arrested after contacting an undercover American agent about selling the cocaine through Honduras, the Wall Street Journal reported, citing two sources whom it says are familiar with the matter. First Lady Celia Flores, 62, is referred to by President Maduro as the first combatant and is highly influential in the government led by her husband, correspondents say.